One of the things I'm greatly thankful for at Faith Bible Church is how responsive people here are to the Word of God. They hear it and they want to obey it. I, I just love that about our church. There's so much opportunity for lay folks like myself to get opportunities to lead and be involved in ministry. As a lay person, there's no way I could ever do the responsibilities and the tasks of ministry in a junior high ministry without a great staff. So I'm really thankful for our staff. Everybody on our staff has just been such a blessing. Well, first of all, I'm thankful for the people that show up to the CG every week, that have their homework done, that they're ready to share what God's doing in their life and encourage one another. FBC is a church where people practice the one another's. You love each other, pray for each other, bear one another's burdens. It's not a church where you sit and hear the sermon and then go home, but you're truly in one another's lives, helping each other grow in the Word of God. We have a group of seniors who are not just interested in hearing a good sermon, but learning also how to let that impact their life. And so I thank you seniors for being such a blessing in my life as I watch you grow. I'm thankful for the evangelism ministry, for a church that supports reaching the lost. You know, a lot of churches are very self-focused. They only seem to care about the Christians within their four walls. And so I'm thankful for the people, the Christians in this church, who have come out for the first time this year and, and got past their fears, stepped out of their comfort zone, and just attempted to reach a lost and dying world for Jesus Christ. That's what I'm thankful for. I'm thankful for our children's ministry leadership team who allow us to function on a Sunday morning. We would not be able to do it without them. I'm also thankful for our children's ministry teachers and workers who serve faithfully every week, prepping lessons, preparing materials, and praying for the kids here at FBC. And I'm so thankful for the women of our church. There's just so many women who love me and care for me and inspire me to good deeds and are iron sharpening iron in my life. And they love my children and they are faithful and praying for both me and my children. I am super thankful for the faithful deacons that I serve with along with the interns. The men at work and the mad crew who put on events for the youth. God has put a love in their hearts for their own kids and others as well. And without their efforts, none of the events that we put on would be possible. I'm really thankful for the students in high school ministry. A specific example of that is our senior guys who uh, serve every Sunday morning and set up and tear down. You'll see them wandering around this, the campus just serving the Lord uh, with glad hearts and, and I'm thankful for that as a high school pastor and even girls in our ministry that are serving in children's ministry, making every effort to serve the Lord and serve the church. Um, and it's just something I'm really thankful for. I am so thankful at Faith Bible Church this year for the way that the congregation has grown in its excitement and enthusiasm to sing worship along with us. And I'm also thankful for the band members and the worship team members who have been so faithful and consistent in their service to the congregation as a whole. Serena and I have been at Faith Bible Church for almost two years now, and I can honestly say that we are just as thankful for every single person at FBC as we were when we first arrived. So there's many things that I'm thankful about here at FBC. Our leadership and their dedication to uh, pouring into men and women, uh, to serving here at uh, Faith Bible. I'm just thankful for the servant's hearts of the body of FBC. There's just so much that goes into making a lay run, set up, tear down church work each week. Uh, and it's just such a blessing to see the body come together using their gifts to make that happen and to make church happen each week.